Welcome back everyone! In the last episode, I cut it off so you wouldn't have to see me go through more battles and therefore waste more time since I'm on a 10 minute limit here. And um, yeah, I just put the sun and moonstones in and now they're gonna move to reveal switches. I already know what to do. Basically, you wanna hold him there, you wanna go over here and then release and jump. And there you go. Then that'll break away. Which that text on it tells you that you're supposed to do that. Not actually go like, use Koops on one, use Mario on the other. It just says you gotta hit them at the same time. You just gotta think a little outside the bind. I think there's something to the left. I might be wrong and I may look like a dumbass. Yep, I look like a dumbass. I keep thinking they're secret. So yeah, wasting about 30 seconds right there. But anyway, here we are, finally, almost... I think this is like part 11? I don't know, I didn't count. Yeah, I'm going to save. I'm going to go through here, for reasons. There it is. Hooktail Castle. With a broken bridge. Oh man, Hooktail Castle. The stories were all true. This place is terrifying. Yes indeed, Coops. Yes indeed. Whoa, don't want to fall. Alright, then we use him. HP Plus. Which, like a faggot, I'm going to equip. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> about all you are going through. Why the fuck did you level up your HP, you son of a bitch? I don't know, but that basically just gave my FP or BP a free double. I think I'll give it to my BP, since I know there's going to be a lot more of those pluses that I'm going to want to equip, among other things. So, I think what I'm going to do is... Level up my FP next, and then for the next two levels, level up my BP, so... Yeah. But that's... But still, that's if I level up that many times in this. Yeah, I know, I'm kind of a hypocrite. I'm like, give me your suggestions for levels and stuff, and I'm basically doing it on my own, but... This is just Chapter 1 level ups. I guarantee you I'm going to need your strategies for the long run. I mean, like, Chapter 2 and onward, I'm going to actually listen to the suggestions. For Chapter 1, though, I'm pretty much just going to be handling it myself. But Chapter 2, like, field is open. You sit down. Darn. Missed it again. I'm gone and I suck. Damn. And there we go. And Luigi was in the audience, in case you didn't notice him down there in the little corner. And then I got smacked. Yeah, no. Multi bounce. That was probably a very bad idea. No, oh, courage shell. Fuck. Well, it looks like I'm gonna have to rely on my counterattacks to hurt him. These are like the best thing in the world, I swear. Koops' shell toss is just like your hammer, it can only attack the frontmost enemy. See, this is why counterattacking is good. Because it ignores all defense. Darn. Just to show you how ineffective this is. And dead. Didn't even have to wait for his buff to wear off.
Alright, so, yeah, Hooktail Castle is weird. Oh, for goodness sake. Oh, and I missed the counter. I look like a total dipshit. And then I missed the action command. I look like an ass. God bless it. I don't know what to do. I'll do that. Yeah. Fudge. Bless it. I should have used multi bounce. I just now realized that. I'm about to get the shit kicked out of me. <sighs> no, you are not hurting me, little boy. We're gonna shell toss. Oh, for goodness sake. What is he doing? Okay. Yeah, sometimes a random audience member will run up to the backstage and, like, do something random. They'll either drop, like, an electrical light on the enemy doing damage to them yet giving them a zap shield or I'm gonna save that for later or they'll like do something that just damages them they might even do something to remove status ailments and they might even notice a random pile of bones over there oh no these bones, they remind me of my father. There's, there's no doubt about it. It's my father. Dad! Um, wait, what's this? Mario, my father's clutching some kind of letter. Or at least his, his bones are. So, what should I do? Should I read it? Yeah, read it. Okay, I can do this. I I'll read it. I came to this castle to destroy Hooktail, but I am stuck and can go no further. So in this letter, I shall note Hooktail's weaknesses for those who follow. The dread Hooktail cannot tolerate creatures beginning that begin with C-R and end with I-C-K-E-T. Hidden somewhere in this castle is an item related to Hooktail's weakness. If one is to have any hope of defeating Hooktail, one must first find that item. One last thing. Faced with ultimate doom, the fiend will use any trick to save itself. If you hope to defeat it, do not give in to your kinder nature and fall for its tricks. Alas, I do not have the strength to continue writing. Already mist veils my eyes. My last words go to my son. Colorado, I love you. And I'm proud of who you've become. Huh? My son Colorado? Not Coops? Oops! Um, yeah, I guess this is my father after all. But if this isn't my father, what if that pile of bones over there is my dad? So, yeah, it's gonna be mini boss time in the next episode because that's just what I said. Peace out.